Hi everyone, I hope you're all having a wonderful day or night wherever you are in the world. Today's video is a bit of a back to school supplies haul, but it is specific to college. College is a little bit different in terms of the school supplies that you need. You generally don't need as many things and they aren't as specific as say in middle school or high school. You don't get like a school supply list that you need to go to the store and buy. You don't need to bring things like tissue boxes or glue sticks and binders, things like that. Basically it's up to you what you want to buy, what works best for you. So I'm going to show you guys what I picked up and what I think is crucial to your college school supplies. So let's do this thing. So the majority of what I got is pens and pencils. I personally don't need a lot of stuff for college. I usually just use the basics. So since I do only get the basics, I like to get a good amount of them. So, for pens, I picked up the Big Atlantis pens. These are um, ball pens, and they are in black ink, and they're supposedly the super smooth writing, so I wanted to get a couple of those. This comes in a pack of five, and then I also got the one in the blue ink. So, I use pens a lot, and I think they are very essential to writing notes, and using them in a planner, and things like that. And then I also ended up getting just some really cheap Papermate black pens. These aren't as fancy as the Big Atlantis ones. These are just super basic. And um, I just got this one because it comes with 11 ballpoint pens. And I don't know, it's just a really good deal for these. And then I got pencils. So first I got a 27 pack of the Big Atlantis mechanical pencils. I particularly have always loved these pencils. They're like the sparkly ones. I know I'm such a nerd. This is so ridiculous. But um, I remember like when I was in middle school and high school, everyone had the sparkly pencils and I never got them because I always got like the super, super cheap pencils. But so I decided to get the sparkly ones. I know it's pretty lame. But yeah, I got a 27 pack because you do need a lot of pencils for college, taking notes, things like that. And then my mom purchased for me two packs of the plain Bic mechanical pencils. These are called Extra Life mechanical pencils, so I'm guessing they last longer. It says that one Bic mechanical pencil is equal to two and a half wood pencils, so I don't know. Then my mom helped me out and she got me some more school supplies. Um, I got some folders. Now, I prefer the plastic folders because the paper folders always rip and they never last very long, so I like to get the plastic ones. Um, these are just basic plastic folders and I got like one, two, three, four, five different folders. Um, I like to mix it up, get a few different colors, but obviously you can tell I really like this color. <laughs> But yeah, I just use these folders for all my different subjects, and then when I get into second semester, I just take everything out of them and then use them for the different subjects for that semester. So I will use these all year long. And then I also got some college rule notebooks. Um, I prefer college ruled because you can just get more on one single piece of paper, and I hate wide ruled notebooks. But these are just basic wide ruled notebooks, nothing too fancy. I got a couple different colors. These will definitely come in handy for writing notes in class. The last thing I have is not new to me. I have had this since last year, um, but it is a planner. I feel like personally a planner is something that is very helpful for a college student. It really helps you plan out when your assignments are due, when exams are coming up, projects, things like that. And because of the structure of college courses and the college semester, it really helps to know in advance when things are coming up because things are so spread out. It's not like in high school where you have assignments due every night or every other night. In college, a lot of it is just more long term. So it's really good to have a reference to know when things are coming up. This, I think I got, where did I get this? Barnes & Noble? That's probably where I got it. Um, or Marshalls. 
Marshalls, Barnes & Noble, they both have really great planners. This one I like just because of the design on the cover. And then it has like a spot for phone numbers. Um, it has like the yearly view so you can see everything for the whole entire year. And then it's got important dates and like uh, if you're into the zodiac signs, it's got that on here too. It's got a map and then as you can see I have written stuff in here from all last year. This is a 2016, 2017 uh, planner. It's, I'm laughing because I'm seeing a bunch of stuff that happened last year. It's just it's kind of cute. But yeah, I like to write down like when assignments are coming up and also I like to write down when like memorable things happen so that I can look back on the planner and see what happened that year. But yeah, this is what I like to keep on hand in my book bag all year round. It really helps stay organized. So that is basically all that I got for college school supplies. It really isn't very much and it's super basic. And I personally don't like binders because they're too bulky and I don't like carrying them around. So that is mainly what I use for college. If you guys want a video about like everything that I use to stay organized in college and not just like what I recently purchased, then let me know in a comment below and I'll make a video about that. And then I also made a quick trip to Forever 21. I haven't really done any back to school like clothing shopping, so I thought I would get a couple things. The first thing you're already looking at it is this flannel. So I got this, it's like red and black and white and like a dark blue colored flannel. I think this flannel is super comfortable and I think it's great for the fall season. The other thing that I got was a fall jacket. This jacket, I put it on and I instantly loved it. So I bought it because I knew that I would get a lot of use out of it for the fall season and I think this will just be great for when I am chilly in school because I always feel like the college classrooms are super chilly but that's just me I guess. Um, so I got this, it is a like army olive green jacket. The fabric is almost like suede, it's like a really soft, almost velvety texture on the outside. So it is, like I said, like an army green, it has the hood on the back, so that'll be good if it's like raining or just chilly, I can use the hood. And then I also really love the details on this, it has this nice drawstring and it has like the little brown grip on here. And then it's just got a lot of like gold detailing. Um, if I can like find a picture of it on the Forever 21 website, I will put it here somewhere to show you guys a better look at it. And then it's got like this almost like jean looking fabric on the inside, which I think really goes well with the green. And then it's got the pockets on the sides, which show you guys it's got the pockets on the sides so I could put like my phone in here my wallet and then it's got the buttons as well so I personally already have a ton of clothing so I did not want to waste money spending on a ton of new clothes but I do feel like this is a good staple item for the fall season and the new school year so that is all that I got for my back to school supplies haul. Let me know if you guys want another video about what I use to study for college and stay organized. Like this video if you enjoyed it or found it helpful and make sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified every time I put up something new. I upload new videos every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday so be on the lookout for those and until my next video I will see you guys soon. Bye guys!